Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Sherry Terrell. I am very proud to be one of the co-authors of this book, The Mindfulness and Acceptance Workbook for Teen Anxiety. This book is based on a type of therapy called acceptance and commitment therapy. It's sort of a third wave of cognitive behavior therapy or CBT, which you might have heard of. And what this book really gets at, um, using ACT as it's called, is how to accept what's inside, to make room for thoughts and feelings, and to still move ahead with the life that we want and be the person that we want. So it's not about disputing our thoughts, it's not about getting rid of feelings, it's about taking it with us, not getting so derailed by it, and doing what matters. And we know that being a teenager is a tough job. We also know that being a parent is a really tough job. And if you're watching these videos, you probably are here to support your teen. So we've made the videos with that in mind. What you're going to get in each video is an idea of the content of the book that your teen has so that you have a little summary of what they're learning. Then we're gonna give you a little idea of what you might try for yourself. The book is very experiential. We want the teens to learn things from the inside out as opposed to us just telling them things. And we'd like you as the parent to have that same experience. So we give you a little experiential something to try to kind of get the idea from the inside. And then we give you some suggestions of things you might want to try as a parent to tweak things a little bit, which you are welcome to, you know, take it as it is, edit it, not take it at all if it doesn't see you. Totally fine. Um, so that's what's in the videos. And as I said, we've made them short. We do strongly suggest you go through them in order because the skills and the ideas do build upon each other. So go in order and don't rush yourself through it. What I will ask you to do though is even right now, just think of a moment when you were at your parenting best. What is a moment as a parent where you're like, I nailed this. I was such a good, supportive, empathetic, helpful parent. And just bring that moment to mind and notice how it feels in your body and then bring to mind a moment when you were not your parenting best. I know I have had those, I think we all have, where you know our kids are really struggling and in the back of our heads we're saying, be patient, be empathetic, don't keep talking, and out of our mouth stuff is happening and we're just not our parenting best. And notice how those moments feel in your body. And even notice what thoughts and feelings might show up in those moments. And it's quite likely as you move through the video series and you're paying attention to your parenting and who you want to be, that those thoughts and feelings are going to show up and get in your way a little bit. So part of going through the video series is to bring with you a sense of curiosity about what might show up inside, a sense of kindness and self-compassion for what might show up inside and some patience, and a sense of willingness to truly authentically have your thoughts and feelings for the sake of being the parent you want to be and supporting your adolescent. And hopefully what we give you along the way will help you to develop that willingness and to take the thoughts and feelings with you. I do want to stress that this book is not therapy. It's not therapy for your adolescent. It's not therapy for you. So if what's in the self-help book is not enough for your teen and what you're learning and trying is not enough, you really may want to reach out and find a qualified therapist for yourself your adolescent or perhaps even your family. We do have a much um, longer in-depth version of this coming out hopefully in 2021. It's not ready yet. Um, it will also not be therapy but it will be a little bit more than this is. We do welcome your feedback and your questions in the meantime and we do hope that this is helpful.